Well, standing here now, next to the car, <laughs> I'm really quite nervous. So it's quite good to actually see the car um, before tomorrow when we take to the track. The temptation to drive fast on this track is going to be high. Um, I obviously want to set a really fast time, so it's going to be quite hard to attempt to hold back and drive sensibly for the first couple of laps at least. I actually um, did have a quick chat with Sebastian Buemi earlier and he just said, just stay in the middle of the track. It's really, really narrow, just stay in the middle of the track. Uh, so I would say I'm feeling relatively underprepared and quite nervous. Same procedure, you're gonna mm -hmm. go out and begin to warm the tyres up, warm the brakes up first and the tyres will get heat through the brakes. So you're just going to spend a little bit of time breaking how that accelerator. How long? Okay, so on my outlap, but I should. How long will it take me to heat up the tyres? Uh, more than your outlap. Yeah. Okay. Let's say if it's in dry conditions, more than your outlap. Okay. Yeah. But I've only really got my outlap. No, you've got your outlap three laps. Well, I want to be setting a time in those three laps. You set. You might set a time <laughs> on the on the third lap. Okay. <laughs> I mean, the fact that we are doing a human versus machine kind of experiment here, you know, it's never been done before. It's definitely never been done in Hong Kong on a street circuit, that's for sure. Um, so to be part of it is going to be pretty amazing. And I can't wait to see what happens. I'm very intrigued to see what result we're going to get. So we've got quite a short session, but we're going to try and fit into the session. Nikki doing a series of laps, including a flying lap and take a time from that and then directly compare that back to back with our AI doing a flying lap and take a time. So in those senses, it's quite a fair challenge. She's got five laps, we've just got three. Uh, so it, there's a chance it could be quite close. The moment of truth, oh my gosh. I'm literally gonna take to the track here in Hong Kong. Super excited, uh, kind of nervous about the whole thing, but I've decided I made a mental note last night that I'm going to sit back, relax, and enjoy it. And uh, may the best man or woman win. So Nikki's just done her five laps, um, and now we've got the car on track doing it in AI. We're just putting in our initial warm-up laps, and then we're going to put in our own time. Race control to crew, please confirm AI uh, lap now. Okay, we'll do it now. Relieved, <laughs> happy, um, although obviously slightly disappointed because, you know, as I said before, uh, I'm a huge fan of this technology. So if the technology had one, it would be awesome. I mean, it was amazing, amazing to see DevBot go round, you know, in complete autonomous mode, driving insanely fast around a ridiculously tight street circuit. 
you know, makes you think that the, the possibilities are endless, really. Yeah, for sure, we've got to actually try and beat Nicky. You know, that's the next step. We've got to actually come here and then beat the driver and beat the driver's time. What's really impressive for me is that we actually set two identical lap times, well, within a thousandth of a second. So that shows you the accuracy of the software, which is what this test was all about. Now we can develop the speed on that. So we're getting there, we're getting closer.